Basal insulin is needed 24 hours a day between meals and during the night to move glucose into cells and provide energy the body needs. The pump delivers small amounts of insulin throughout each hour of the day and night. The amount of basal insulin needed each hour is entered as a basal rate. The insulin needed to cover all 24 hours of the day and night is called a basal pattern. When Tina first started on her pump, her doctor determined that Tina should have a basal pattern that has only one basal rate of 0.75 units per hour. Tina programmed this basal rate in her pump. Let's see how this is done. Press select to open the main menu. Press down to basal and press select. Press down again to delivery settings and press select. Press down to basal pattern setup and press select. Press select on basal one to add the first basal rate. Press select on options, then select edit. Press select on the time segment. Press select again since the end time will not change. Hold the up button to scroll to 0.75 units per hour and press select. Select done. Here is where we verify that the basal rate has been entered correctly. Select save. Over time, the basal rates in the basal pattern may need to be changed or added to adjust to the body's various insulin needs. Once a basal pattern is set correctly, your glucose levels should stay stable so things like sleeping late, eating late, or even skipping a meal can happen without glucose going too high or too low. After a few days on pump therapy, Tina has noticed her blood glucose values have improved but are still a bit high during the day. Her healthcare professional advises her to increase her basal rate from 0.75 to 0.9 units per hour between 8 a.m. and 6 p.m. To do this, press Select to open the main menu. Press Down to Basal and press Select. Press Down again to Delivery Settings and press Select. Press down to basal pattern setup and press select. Press select on basal one. Press select on options, then select edit. Press select on the time segment. Press up to 8 a.m. and press select. Press select again to keep the current rate of 0.75 as the rate for this time segment. Press select on the end time segment and scroll up to 6 p.m. Press up to change the units per hour to 0.9 and press select. Press select on the end time segment and scroll up to 12 a.m. Press up to change the units per hour to 0.75 and press select. Select done. Here we see that the 24-hour total has changed to 19.5 and verify the basal rates are correct. Select Save. Tina is happy with how her basal rates help keep her in good control and finds it much easier than having to take an injection at the same time every night.